What is your favorite farm animal? I really like horses. They're majestic and fun to ride. What is your favorite farm animal? I really like horses. They're majestic and fun to ride. How do you start your day on the farm? I usually wake up early to feed the chickens and collect eggs. How do you start your day on the farm? I usually wake up early to feed the chickens and collect eggs. What's the most challenging task on the farm for you? Dealing with stubborn goats can be quite challenging sometimes. What's the most challenging task on the farm for you? Dealing with stubborn goats can be quite challenging sometimes. Do you have any favorite crops to grow? I enjoy growing tomatoes. They're versatile and can be used in many dishes. Do you have any favorite crops to grow? I enjoy growing tomatoes. They're versatile and can be used in many dishes. How do you relax after a long day of farm work? I like sitting by the barn, watching the sunset and enjoying the peacefulness. How do you relax after a long day of farm work? I like sitting by the barn. Watching the sunset and enjoying the peacefulness. What's the best part about living on a farm? Being close to nature and having a strong sense of community with fellow farmers. What's the best part about living on a farm? Being close to nature and having a strong sense of community with fellow farmers. Have you ever tried making homemade jam with farm fruits? Yes, I love making jam with fresh berries from the farm. It's delicious. Have you ever tried making homemade jam with farm fruits? Yes, I love making jam with fresh berries from the farm. It's delicious. What kind of machinery do you use on the farm? We use tractors for plowing and planting, and a combine during harvest season. What kind of machinery do you use on the farm? We use tractors for plowing and planting, and a combine during harvest season. How do you handle pests on the farm without using harmful chemicals? We use natural predators like ladybugs to control pests and maintain a balanced ecosystem. How do you handle pests on the farm without using harmful chemicals? We use natural predators like ladybugs to control pests and maintain a balanced ecosystem. Do you participate in any farmer's markets to sell your produce? Yes, we set up a booth at the local farmer's market to sell our fresh fruits and vegetables. Do you participate in any farmer's markets to sell your produce? Yes, we set up a booth at the local farmer's market to sell our fresh fruits and vegetables. What's your favorite memory from working on the farm? One of my favorite memories is the first time we successfully harvested a bumper crop of pumpkins. What's your favorite memory from working on the farm? One of my favorite memories is the first time we successfully harvested a bumper crop of pumpkins. How do you deal with unpredictable weather on the farm? 
We keep a close eye on the weather forecast and take preventive measures like covering crops during storms. How do you deal with unpredictable weather on the farm? We keep a close eye on the weather forecast and take preventive measures like covering crops during storms. Do you have any farm dogs to help with herding or protection? Yes. We have a loyal border collie who helps with herding the sheep and keeps a watchful eye on the farm. Do you have any farm dogs to help with herding or protection? Yes. We have a loyal border collie who helps with herding the sheep and keeps a watchful eye on the farm. How do you involve the local community in farm activities? We organize seasonal events like pumpkin picking and hayrides to involve the community and create a sense of togetherness. How do you involve the local community in farm activities? We organize seasonal events like pumpkin picking and hayrides to involve the community and create a sense of togetherness. What's your favorite farm-related tradition? Every year, we have a harvest festival where the community comes together to celebrate the abundance of the season. What's your favorite farm-related tradition? Every year, we have a harvest festival where the community comes together to celebrate the abundance of the season. How do you ensure the farm stays sustainable for future generations? We practice organic farming, rotate crops, and use eco-friendly methods to ensure the land remains fertile for years to come. How do you ensure the farm stays sustainable for future generations? We practice organic farming, rotate crops, and use eco-friendly methods to ensure the land remains fertile for years to come. Have you ever hosted educational programs for schools on the farm? Yes, we welcome local schools for field trips to educate students about farming, sustainability, and the importance of agriculture. Have you ever hosted educational programs for schools on the farm? Yes. We welcome local schools for field trips to educate students about farming, sustainability, and the importance of agriculture. What's the most rewarding part of farm life for you? Seeing the fruits of our labor, quite literally, and knowing that we contribute to providing fresh, local produce to the community. What's the most rewarding part of farm life for you? Seeing the fruits of our labor, quite literally, and knowing that we contribute to providing fresh, local produce to the community. How do you handle the balance between modern technology and traditional farming methods? We embrace technology for efficiency but also value traditional methods that have been passed down through generations. How do you handle the balance between modern technology and traditional farming methods? We embrace technology for efficiency but also value traditional methods that have been passed down through generations. Are there any specific farm chores you enjoy doing together as a couple? We both enjoy tending to the vegetable garden and planting seeds together. It's a collaborative and rewarding experience. Are there any specific farm chores you enjoy doing together as a couple? 
we both enjoy tending to the vegetable garden and planting seeds together it's a collaborative and rewarding experience. Do you have any favorite farm-themed books or movies that capture the essence of farm life? We love reading books like Charlotte's Web and watching movies like Babe that portray the charm of farm life. Do you have any favorite farm-themed books or movies that capture the essence of farm life? We love reading books like Charlotte's Web and watching movies like Babe that portray the charm of farm life. How do you handle the challenges of seasonal changes affecting your crops? We plan our crop rotations carefully and choose crops that are well suited for each season to minimize the impact of seasonal changes. How do you handle the challenges of seasonal changes affecting your crops? We plan our crop rotations carefully and choose crops that are well suited for each season to minimize the impact of seasonal changes. What's your go-to recipe using fresh produce from the farm? We enjoy making a simple and delicious salad with freshly harvested lettuce, tomatoes, and cucumbers. What's your go-to recipe using fresh produce from the farm? We enjoy making a simple and delicious salad with freshly harvested lettuce, tomatoes, and cucumbers. How do you involve children in farm activities to teach them about agriculture? We organize family-friendly farm tours and activities, allowing children to experience hands-on learning about where their food comes from. How do you involve children in farm activities to teach them about agriculture? We organize family-friendly farm tours and activities, allowing children to experience hands-on learning about where their food comes from. Have you ever faced any unexpected surprises on the farm, and how did you handle them? Once, we had a surprise visit from a lost sheep. We safely returned it to its owner and made sure our fences were secure. Have you ever faced any unexpected surprises on the farm? And how did you handle them? Once, we had a surprise visit from a lost sheep. We safely returned it to its owner and made sure our fences were secure. Are there any farm festivals or events you look forward to attending in your community? We always look forward to the county fair, where farmers showcase their best crops, livestock, and handmade goods. Are there any farm festivals or events you look forward to attending in your community? We always look forward to the county fair, where farmers showcase their best crops, livestock, and handmade goods. How do you manage water conservation on the farm, especially during dry seasons? We implement drip irrigation systems and rainwater harvesting techniques to efficiently use water and conserve resources. How do you manage water conservation on the farm, especially during dry seasons? We implement drip irrigation systems and rainwater harvesting techniques to efficiently use water and conserve resources. What's the role of bees on your farm, and how do you support pollination? Bees are essential for pollination. 
We maintain beehives and plant pollinator-friendly flowers to support their role in the ecosystem. What's the role of bees on your farm? And how do you support pollination? Bees are essential for pollination. We maintain beehives and plant pollinator-friendly flowers to support their role in the ecosystem. How do you handle the disposal of organic waste on the farm? We compost organic waste, turning it into nutrient-rich soil that benefits our crops. How do you handle the disposal of organic waste on the farm? We compost organic waste, turning it into nutrient-rich soil that benefits our crops. Do you have any favorite farm-related traditions during the holiday season? We love decorating the farm with festive lights and hosting a holiday market where locals can purchase handmade crafts and farm fresh goods. Do you have any favorite farm-related traditions during the holiday season? We love decorating the farm with festive lights and hosting a holiday market where locals can purchase handmade crafts and farm fresh goods. What's your approach to pest control without harming beneficial insects on the farm? We use natural predators like praying mantises and ladybugs to control pests promoting a healthy and balanced ecosystem. What's your approach to pest control without harming beneficial insects on the farm? We use natural predators like praying mantises and ladybugs to control pests, promoting a healthy and balanced ecosystem. How do you handle the marketing and branding of your farm products? We have a farm stand with a rustic charm, and we use social media to showcase our products and connect with customers. How do you handle the marketing and branding of your farm products? We have a farm stand with a rustic charm and we use social media to showcase our products and connect with customers. Have you ever faced any humorous or amusing situations while working on the farm? Once, a curious goat managed to sneak into the farmhouse, causing a bit of chaos. We had a good laugh while gently guiding it back outside. Have you ever faced any humorous or amusing situations while working on the farm? Once, a curious goat managed to sneak into the farmhouse, causing a bit of chaos. We had a good laugh while gently guiding it back outside. How do you prepare the farm for winter, and what seasonal activities do you engage in? We insulate our animals' shelters, stock up on hay, and enjoy winter activities like sledding and making snowmen on the farm. How do you prepare the farm for winter, and what seasonal activities do you engage in? We insulate our animals' shelters, stock up on hay and enjoy winter activities like sledding and making snowmen on the farm. Do you have any farm-related hobbies or crafts you enjoy during your downtime? We love crafting handmade soaps using goat milk from our farm. It's a creative way to utilize our resources. Do you have any farm-related hobbies or crafts you enjoy during your downtime? We love crafting handmade soaps using goat milk from our farm. 
it's a creative way to utilize our resources. What's your favorite aspect of tending to livestock on the farm? Building a connection with the animals and seeing their individual personalities emerge over time is truly rewarding. What's your favorite aspect of tending to livestock on the farm? Building a connection with the animals and seeing their individual personalities emerge over time is truly rewarding. How do you involve the local community in sustainable practices and environmental awareness? We host workshops and seminars on sustainable farming practices, encouraging community members to adopt eco-friendly habits. How do you involve the local community in sustainable practices and environmental awareness? We host workshops and seminars on sustainable farming practices, encouraging community members to adopt eco-friendly habits. What's the most unusual or exotic crop you've ever attempted to grow on the farm? We once tried growing dragon fruit, which was a unique and fascinating experiment although it proved challenging in our climate. What's the most unusual or exotic crop you've ever attempted to grow on the farm? We once tried growing dragon fruit, which was a unique and fascinating experiment, although it proved challenging in our climate. How do you celebrate milestones and achievements on the farm? We gather friends and neighbors for a farm-themed barbecue, sharing stories and celebrating the successes of the season. How do you celebrate milestones and achievements on the farm? We gather friends and neighbors for a farm-themed barbecue sharing stories and celebrating the successes of the season. How do you handle the farm's energy needs, and have you considered renewable energy sources? We use solar panels to generate electricity for some of our farm operations, reducing our dependence on traditional power sources. How do you handle the farm's energy needs, and have you considered renewable energy sources? We use solar panels to generate electricity for some of our farm operations, reducing our dependence on traditional power sources. Have you ever faced any setbacks or failures on the farm, and how did you overcome them? We once had a crop failure due to unexpected weather conditions. We learned from the experience, adjusted our plans, and planted more resilient crops. Have you ever faced any setbacks or failures on the farm, and how did you overcome them? We once had a crop failure due to unexpected weather conditions. We learned from the experience, adjusted our plans, and planted more resilient crops. How do you involve the younger generation in the continuation of the farm's legacy? We mentor local youth interested in farming, offering internships and educational programs to pass on traditional knowledge and skills. How do you involve the younger generation in the continuation of the farm's legacy? We mentor local youth interested in farming, offering internships and educational programs to pass on traditional knowledge and skills. What's the role of Community Supported Agriculture CSA in your farm, if any? 
We have a CSA program where community members can subscribe to receive a weekly box of fresh produce. Fostering a direct connection between farmers and consumers. What's the role of Community Supported Agriculture CSA in your farm, if any? We have a CSA program where community members can subscribe to receive a weekly box of fresh produce. Fostering a direct connection between farmers and consumers. How do you stay informed about the latest advancements in sustainable farming practices? We attend agricultural conferences, read industry publications, and participate in online forums to stay updated on the latest sustainable farming techniques. How do you stay informed about the latest advancements in sustainable farming practices? We attend agricultural conferences, read industry publications, and participate in online forums to stay updated on the latest sustainable farming techniques. How do you handle the farm's waste management, especially non-organic materials? We recycle as much as possible and responsibly dispose of non-organic waste, minimizing our environmental impact. How do you handle the farm's waste management, especially non-organic materials? We recycle as much as possible and responsibly dispose of non-organic waste, minimizing our environmental impact. What's your favorite season on the farm, and why? I love spring because it's a time of renewal. The farm comes to life with blossoming flowers, baby animals, and the promise of a bountiful harvest. What's your favorite season on the farm, and why? I love spring because it's a time of renewal. The farm comes to life with blossoming flowers, baby animals, and the promise of a bountiful harvest. How do you engage with local schools to educate students about agriculture and the importance of farming? We collaborate with schools to organize farm tours, workshops, and interactive activities that teach students about the entire farming process. How do you engage with local schools to educate students about agriculture and the importance of farming? We collaborate with schools to organize farm tours, workshops, and interactive activities that teach students about the entire farming process. How do you balance the demands of farm life with personal time and relaxation? It's important to schedule breaks and downtime. We enjoy nature walks around the farm and quiet evenings by the bonfire. How do you balance the demands of farm life with personal time and relaxation? It's important to schedule breaks and downtime. We enjoy nature walks around the farm and quiet evenings by the bonfire. What role does technology play in optimizing your farm's productivity and efficiency? We use farm management software to track crop cycles, monitor weather patterns, and streamline various tasks, enhancing overall efficiency. What role does technology play in optimizing your farm's productivity and efficiency? We use farm management software to track crop cycles, monitor weather patterns, and streamline various tasks, enhancing overall efficiency. 
How do you manage the farm's water resources efficiently during the growing season? We implement drip irrigation systems, practice rainwater harvesting, and monitor water usage closely to ensure efficient and sustainable water management. How do you manage the farm's water resources efficiently during the growing season? We implement drip irrigation systems, practice rainwater harvesting, and monitor water usage closely to ensure efficient and sustainable water management.